and I am going to give you your outdoor edge tip of the week and I'm going to show you how to cut around the horns of an antelope to take the cape off. That's one of the really important cuts you make. I'm actually going to use the Razor Max Outdoor Edge knife. This is a new knife from Outdoor Edge. What's really cool about it, it's got a regular blade right here that's similar to the other ones that I use in some of my other Outdoor Edge knives. It just clicks in, but they also have a longer fillet slash boning knife that you can use for butchering. But on an antelope, to keep it out, one of the super important cuts you want to make is you pull the hair down around the horn. This is a carrot and sheath. And what you want to do is go down here, feeling with the knife until it gets soft. And you'll notice I'm pushing the hair down and I'm just making a little cut around the horn where it drops down. Now this is important if you want to measure this antelope for score for Pope and Young or Boone and Crockett. You can actually mess up and I could actually cut through this horn right here. But by going down low, and I'm moving the hair out of the way, so once the taxidermist gets a hold of it, he can uh, put that hair back up around the horn. But I do this all the way around the horn here, all the way through to the back side. And I've got other outdoor edge tips on how to take the cape off. But that, for your outdoor edge tip of the week, is using the brand new Razor Max knife from Outdoor Edge and I'm showing you how to cut around the horn of an antelope so you can take the cape.